This is Dr. Andrew Jones. In this edition of Veterinary Secrets, I'm sharing some sad news about Jesse. Sad news about Jesse. Jesse, my 18-year-old dog who's been sick with a variety of ailments, died last week. He was euthanized comfortably at home with the rest of his family present. He still wagged his tail that morning, but after a short walk to pee, he was unable to stand. Jesse came to us after my father died in 2010. At the time, he was thought to be not the best behaved dog, and the sound of my dad yelling, Jesse, was heard by all the neighbors frequently. But he seemed to choose me. Immediately after my dad died, he jumped into the back of our vehicle, assuming he was to come home with me, and he did. He turned out to be a great dog. He bonded with all of us, although he tended to follow me around, even waiting to go upstairs to bed until he saw me coming upstairs. Jesse walked with our kids to the bus to school. He barked to warn us of threats from attacking squirrels, chased away the evil skunks, which led, of course, to a big supply of skunk off. He went running and mountain biking with me, and as little as a year and a half ago, he went for a 50k run. He was filled with personality, always talking when he wanted food, or thought he should be having attention instead of someone else. Whenever I hugged my wife Catherine, he would go off with his urr dog talking, as if to say, don't hug her, hug me. You'd think it gets easier as pets get older, but unfortunately not. But he added so much to me and my family, and I'm so glad he came to us. Jesse, you are much loved, and you'll be missed. Dr. Andrew